<laughs> I was not expecting the music to start fucking immediately. <laughs> <coughs> Coin it, Ink. Yeah, okay. Large pile of sparkles. Yeah, what the fuck is this? This isn't- this isn't an animated sprite. This is actually a particle effect. Yeah. That's hovering around where my invisible cursor is. Alright. Oh, Alright, let's go. Oh god, okay. I have to adjust myself to the fucking isometric exercise here. <laughs> okay. I see I have like a one little ditty following me. Ditty. Oh, there's a, oh, there's a timer. That's junk. Oh, no. That's like... Oh, that's an attack of some kind? Oh, what's going on? I don't know. I don't know how this works. Did you just create beans? I think Maybe. you created beans. Um... Okay, so I can swim. Uh-oh. Oh, no. <laughs> this is... unusual. Um... I, I just remember that I wanted to start this video with, like... With some variation of like, did you know you can watch me play Snake in uh, in a YouTube video or something? Um, and then I forgot because I got distracted by the music starting immediately. Oh, that was an excellent noise. <laughs> what the hell even happened? I touched that spike. <laughs> it was like, <laughs> oh my god, what the fuck <laughs> is this game? I don't know, this is, uh... Oh, you, oh, it is eight-directional, hang on. Oh, God. If it's eight-directional, why can't up be... This is up, by the way. Up, down, left, right. It's, like, tilted. It's really annoying. Oh, my God. <laughs> the joy of, uh... No. Not knowing what the fuck you're doing in older games. Yep. Okay, I can't go in that door, apparently. I I'm guessing the goal is just to increase in size. Increase and then... in size. Yeah. yeah. probably. All I know is various things are causing jelly beans to appear. <laughs> yes. I feel- I thought I had seen gameplay of this years ago. Why foot. is there a foot? Yeah, foot. Yeah. I got, I, hurt, I got hurt from touching it. The time limit. The time limit is kind of bad. Why- why- why is licking the foot giving me a bunch of points? <laughs> why can't I see my score? Oh my god, this game. Is, is this the lewdest game we have played? Oh, there we go. I, I beat the foot. I put the foot. You did. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god! Uh... So Quick. Is this, is this, uh, Cactus of Strength supposed to be, like, measuring how many segments you have or something? Probably. Yeah, I think, I think this is gonna be a death and a retry, cause... Probably. I don't know hell. I see a timer up there. I don't know how to get to it, though. Yeah. I'm trying to collect clocks. <laughs> That's the best noise. <laughs> oh, hang on, it just kind of put me here with the new timer. Why do I spit out jelly beans when I eat the fucking. I think you're like. Drink? I think you're like eating an egg and like spitting out the shell or something. I don't Maybe. know. Maybe. Also, I swear I've heard this music somewhere else. Because I don't know if I've ever really watched anything of this game. Oh. But definitely. Okay, so that opens the door. Okay, so that's the level B. Fantastic! <clears throat> okay. I like how it's, you know, comparing the second player that doesn't exist. <laughs> yeah. We could play this two player sometime. <laughs> it sounds like it would be a fun bit of chaos. Chaos, chaos. Man, I've heard this song too. These <laughs> must be from like. I think this is just like random background music from AVGN episodes. Uh. Damn it. It was that diamond gotta man. Work, 
kind of reminded. Yeah, I kind of am curious about that diamond. It is probably just for points. <laughs> Play for points. SNES Live. What? what do you mean I have a fucking wind-up key now? Um, okay. the, the play for points thing is a reference to JonTron's Bubsy video, because in Bubsy 2 there's an option called play for points. And he's like, what do you mean play for points? Ball. Yeah, I gotta get my high score and post it to SNES Live. <laughs> I, I am enjoying the snake's face. Yeah. <laughs> But yeah, I, I enjoy your question of why the fuck is it, if it's eight directional, why is it on a <laughs> tilt? But that's an extremely good question. Like, oh my god, I I'm not fucking used to this. Like I I could probably manage just playing in four directions, but I shouldn't have to. Oh no. No. <laughs> Gotta look out for the, the Grimbo. No. This kind of looks like it controls like a, like a damp squid. Controls like a f fucking Mario Galaxy dream. <laughs> no, fuck off. Controls like a Mario Galaxy dream. Well, you remember how we, how you, there was that post where somebody yeah. said that in Mario Galaxy, oh, we gotta lick the foot again, hang on. Yep. Somebody said that in a Mario Galaxy, Mario controls like a dream. I'm like, what, one of those fucking... <laughs> Dreams where you where can't were waiting through pudding. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No. Galaxy definitely has the worst controls of any 3D Mario game. Like to me, that's not even a contest. But yet, it seems like most people don't have an issue with it. I remember Sunshine controlling totally fine, and yeah, a lot of people claim to have issues controlling that game. And everybody claims that Mario 64 didn't age well and that it's impossible to control. I don't really get it, but... God, this is hard to control. Oh my god, I don't have enough fucking bullshit. How the fuck do you get enough stuff without dying? <laughs> get good. So, the, uh, there was a possibility of this not being a full episode because I, it's like an arcade game. I didn't know how much I was going to get, well, arcade style game. I didn't know how much I was going to be able to get out of it. Um, and uh, yeah, I'm not sure if I can squeeze 30 minutes out of this. We might be switching to another game shortly. Um, oh my God. This game looks fun if you can get used to its brand of bullshit. Yeah. <laughs> well. Like, the thing though is that this just infinitely spits out eggs. It's not like you have to explore the level for them. So what, you yeah. just come here, grow, increase in size, and then climb, <laughs> and then climb up to the exit? Like, that seems kind of stupid. Yeah, it is a little weird. It also seems like taking damage doesn't actually matter. Like, when I get hit by the shock or whatever, or when I touch, like, an enemy. It seems like it I just kind of flash lose. and get stunned. Parts. Um. Oh, what yep. do you mean like length? Yeah. I don't know. I didn't think so. Uh, I gotta keep on burping. You can if you want. You can try, but you would not be successful. Oh yeah, sure enough. Okay. There was a nice noise in the background. I don't know what that was. Okay, so sometimes these up. turn out to be bombs. Like, I delivered bombs in the movie, but I didn't want anybody fucking knowing the, that I fucking did fucking that. It's fucking insulting. Music is so dirty. It reminds me of, like, music you'd hear in a saloon. I think, okay, the fucking emulator lag. That's not my fault. Uh, music lagged. Even though I couldn't anyway be... Cause... <laughs> you fucking cock. You, <laughs> you have to be so fucking precise. Oh my fucking god, I fell <laughs> off the level. And now I gotta Good climb night. the bullshit again. 
Yeah. Which is spectacular. Yeah. Okay. Are we switching, or did you want to keep playing this? <laughs> uh, we might be switching shortly. Okay. I think I think two <laughs> levels is more than enough for this. Let's ha let's have a look at the third level and see if it's much different. I'm guessing it's going to be a lot like level one. <laughs> Cheese wheels of doom. No, this does actually look kind of different, but uh, fuck Damn. it. There's a rapid clam. Okay, I gotta see the. No, that's a toilet seat. <laughs> Alright, anyway. Yeah, be right back. Alright, so you actually know some things about this game. Also. No, I don't. Oh, I thought you did. I have a Cold. few things to say. <laughs> this is one of those games that was, uh. ported to, like, fucking okay. everything, it seems. Secondly, I mean, it's from fucking 1984, so yeah. Secondly, it's made by Milton Bradley, which are like normally a board game company. And yeah. thirdly, this logo is very Indiana Jones, maybe DuckTales, especially on the cover art, where it actually has a similar like yellow orange sort of gradient. But uh, it's my name. Okay. So yeah, be prepared for more uh, isometric exercises. Yep. Rub. Like rub out? Yeah. Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> what do you mean you ninety degree and forty five degree? I guess I guess I'll go with the A type. B this sounds like I'll have more control in this one, but maybe it'll also be harder. So uh. Okay. This is about why yeah, I expected. I exercise. Uh, okay. Good shit. <laughs> okay. Are we about to get to the sad song? <laughs> what do you mean? There's just a sad song in this game, I don't know. Oh, okay. This is the sad song. If you say so. What? <laughs> yup. Did I fall too far? Yeah, you can't you can't fall for shit. Man, <laughs> that seems like the point. Mm. Is that applying a time penalty? Oh my god, I didn't even fall. I just like clipped the ledge. <laughs> my god, this is this is kind of ass. Oh fuck only, you! But yeah, th this I like. I have a weird relationship with this song because it was in um, rom check fail. Ah. Uh, yeah, cylinders. Oh my god, no! <laughs> <laughs> Why are they trying to eat me? Yes. Um. I I'm kind of surprised that this game has physics. Yeah. I mean, I guess that's what they dedicated, like, all the fucking programming to. Oh, for fuck's yeah. sake. But yeah, so this song was in Rum Check Fail. I didn't know what the hell it was from originally, and then I heard it again, like, ages later, and was couldn't remember what the hell I remembered it from and then yeah there, there was really no story there uh, but quick no time oh <laughs> oh wow that was really harsh <laughs> all right so I guess this is gonna be uh yep you you get one life um oh my god <laughs> so I guess you just want to save state at the start of each level and then all right if you say so <clears throat> I have no idea how many levels it has. I've never really been a fan of... Uh, let's try the B mode. Never been a fan of what? Uh, arcade games. I'm, I've never been good at them, really. Yeah, this is controlling I mean, differently than I'm expecting. Is it Snake, Rattle, and Roll style? The other one kind of was, I feel like. I don't know. I think I preferred the other way it was controlled. I don't know how to describe it. it. it I'm guessing in that one, you know, <laughs> down moves down, and this one down moves, like, down left or something. That might be it, yeah. Yeah, I'm... I, I've never really... had much experience with like real life arcades oh like, no i've played no arcade games like actual like, arcade you know, i have like you know very rarely but it's always like 
you know, two seconds of Pac-Man or Galaga or something, and mm-hmm. it's like, okay, whatever. Um, you know, games of that style, I don't, I don't mind them, but it's usually not something I'm going to play for very long. Don't put me back up there. Okay. I still maintain this is the sad song. Fuck. There's like, there's a pretty strong momentum system here as well. Dude, I I like (laughs) didn't... Oh my god. happened there. I don't know. This is spectacular. I'm kind of glad we combined these two into one Mm -hmm. video. I can't can't fucking control it. I'm sorry. (laughs) I thought it was going to put me somewhere else. I somehow have slightly more time. Oh, the goal is right there. Come on. Also, the perspective is kind of fucky. I can't tell. I think this is a pit, but it's hard to tell. Oh my god. This is, uh... I'm finding the 3D-ness impressive, but it's still a little hard to parse. Yeah. Wait, I'm... Okay, let me try holding up here. No. I'm just fucked as soon as I get onto this plane. What the fuck? Is this ice or something? Maybe. Yeah, my trajectory is fucking decided the moment I land on, I land uh, on it. That's the fucking problem. All right, so I guess you want to bump the fucking edge of the screen, I guess. Oof. What? How did I don't you know take what damage? the fuck that was. <laughs> all right. <laughs> oh Christ. Well, level two was impossible. Let's see how level three goes. Mm-hmm. Boo-loo. That was a beginner course. This is an intermediate course. God help my soul. This one's clearly designed to be a race between two players. Oh my god. (laughs) (laughs) Music, what are you doing? No, not the puddle. Eh. 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 (laughs) <laughs> I kind of want to see what the puddles do. I'm guessing they, like, dissolve you or something. That is okay. exactly correct. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> <laughs> the sad little... Just always makes me laugh. Is it better oh. or what? Yeah, there's no time. I don't know how anyone is supposed to fucking play this. Do you have a oh, third wow. thing we can put? <laughs> no, um... Is there an NES port of Qbert? Probably. <laughs> Give me a I second. Mean, oh my god, I'm gonna go have a look. That. I can't play this for another 10 minutes, 12 minutes. Come on. Alright, be right back. Okay, we got Qbert. We've gone back another year. <laughs> Qbert doesn't exist. Jump on squares, change them to the target color. Stay on playfield, jumping off results in field, plumbing unless the disc is avoid all objects, which is not green, just means there's little stinks of his death. Extra life is on each additional 12,000. And he speaks in Grawlixes. Alright. He speaks in what? Grawlixes. This control, okay? I can't. What? This is spectacular. What? Okay. The D pad is showing up. To go upright. Okay, yeah. yeah, then so that's what the text says. Okay. I mean, no. Yeah, that's that's better. Oh, you do it like individually. What the fuck? Okay. No, yes, no, yes. Yes. Let's go. What the fuck is with the V? Look at that. Behold, this this is the game. Mm. I I have played Cubert before in some context. I don't remember where or when. 
but I do I do distinctly remember hating it. <laughs> this is kind of bad. <clears throat> Fuck off. Oh my god. D there's just, it's just it, this feels very luck based. Hey, you did the thing. <laughs> okay, so I think those little rainbow disc things are like platforms you can stand on to escape the bullshit. What the hell is. Uh, what? I didn't know that they could like go on the. Oh, okay, no. Yeah, I did not know that there were enemies that followed a different sense of gravity. That is news to me. Mm. <laughs> Immediately. <laughs> the th there's a weird delay on this where I actually press up left, but it still thought that I was holding down left from like before. It has like a. It like remembers. I don't know. I hate that you don't start with the thing that you're stepping on. Yeah, like, it's a little lame. I pressed up and left. It didn't register. Going on a trip. Do, 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 do. I'm surprised the enemies Fuck aren't, off. like, changing the color back. I thought that's yeah. what they did. Why is oh, this so? A There's nothing you can do about this. This is horrible. <laughs> nope, arcade classic. Why the fuck did anyone like this? Because there were like three video games, and this one was not a shooter. <laughs> fuck. Yep. How was I supposed to know which way it was going? There's no way to know. I guess you're just supposed to stay far away from them because you don't know for sure. I, I don't know. You gotta get your points. Like the, yeah. Uh, there's just vegetable men. Uh, oh, okay. This oh, one's he... shit. Okay. Good. <clears throat> so I've been seeing misinformation about the origins of series names, like, uh, you know, Metroid is called what it is because of the main character, Metroid. Fire Emblem is called that because it's Marth's last name. <laughs> I pr okay, hang on. I pressed up and left, and it was still, like, not good enough. I imagine that, like, the actual arcade cabinet probably had, like a joystick that only moves in the four probably. diagonals or something. And I think this is probably best played with just the four directions tilted 45 degrees. It might be a little bit more responsive. No, it, it no. the problem is not that it wasn't registering at that time. The problem was that it just did it, like, I stepped into the tile as the enemy was leaving and it was still like, oh yeah, you totally got hit by the enemy. That one he kind of just I, jumped on the back. Because I thought it would have left by then. That time, I feel like I should have been able to, like, hop off. Mm, there's our good old friend, Roger Potato. Why the fuck is there a teleport pad at the top? <laughs> oh god. Okay. <laughs> This is it's gonna be really stupid if we played three different games in this and we can't even get to half an hour. <laughs> I, I'm kind of guessing that might be the case. <laughs> oh, I have to step on them twice now? Oh, fun. I mean, I guess it makes sense. Oh, fuck you! <clears throat> so, of the three, I'm thinking, uh, I think we got, we saw a sharp decline in quality between each <laughs> game. Yeah. We could go back to Snake Rattle and Roll. No, I don't know. Oh my god. Wait, it kind of looks like the Minecraft blog, huh? I'm like, shit, is there another isometric arcade style <laughs> NES game? <laughs> there probably is. Oh my is. fucking god, this game sucks ass! It's so bad. I'm looking up isometric NES games. Cobra Triangle. What the fuck? It, is it just 
snake rattle and roll again? It's by rare. What the fuck is Cobra Triangle? Are you sure it's not a different name for it in a different region? Oh, fuck off. Okay, you play as a boat. <laughs> I'm not- I'm not fucking playing it. We're done. I know. <laughs> Three games, 25 minutes. Good enough. <laughs> what, what, an, what an excellent episode. Yes. Alright. Good night. <laughs> Good, 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 good tenth episode right there. Oh my god. <laughs>